Hello and welcome to Travel Size online tutorial. Today I will be showing you how to view an entire manifest and also how to print out a PML manifest. So first things first, let's sign in. For these functions, user level 81 will suffice. And let's start with viewing the manifest. First, by defaulting the flight that we want to operate on. Next, we want to make sure that all PML parts have been processed and all PML parts have been received by using the MV function. And there you have it, it has been processed and received. Now let's get some basic details on our flight by using the SY function. For SY, we did flight followed by flight date followed by the origin city. And it lets us know that we have a boarding number of three. Uh, it gives us some more basic information, our capacity, our aircraft type, our segment, um, boarding time, um, gate number, things like that. Now, let's finally look at the entire P&L by using this function. PD followed by the flight number and the date, and then asterisk the origin city. Now this pulls up just the first page. If we want to see the entire page, we're just going to type in PN1 and all the passengers will be pulled up. Now let's suppose we need to print out the entire manifest by boarding number, we're going to use the JL function. And to give you a better view, let's clear the screen and move up towards the top of the screen. All right, this is better. So if we want to arrange it by boarding number, we do JL colon B, flight, flight number, class, followed by the segment, followed by the PID. I will show you where to find the PID in just a second. But let's transmit this first. It says accepted. And we have a message blinking in the corner. Let's see what it says. This is basically a synopsis of the printing that we will be doing. Now, let me clear the screen and show you where I got the PID number. Once you do DA, You'll see the PID number listed there, and you can type that into the later segment of your command function. Now let's suppose we want to find a printer and print out the manifest according by name. We'll just use N instead of V to arrange it by name. Transmit that. And now it's in accordance by name. Let's suppose we want to organize it by e-ticket number. No problem. Same process. Just replace the N with the E. I also want to note that this is all for the economy class. If you want to switch to business class, just put a J or a C instead of the Y. Now let's organize it according to passengers who are not yet cleared to board. Just replace it with a Q and keep the same following thing. And if for some reason we want to organize it by passengers who have data missing, replace the Q with a P and you'll get the printout. That is how you view an entire manifest and print it out. Stay tuned for more functions on DCS. 